very good morning to each and everyone. First of all, everyone sit properly. Keep your back bone straight. Your body language, your posture should be very, very positive. Rajesh sir recently told you some wonderful dignitaries there at the podium right now. So you have to give a wonderful message that how actually all the people react. Well, during the summer camp, I was uh, an evaluator in board examinations, so I could not assist much. I was here for five days, but this was really a terrific experience. All the teachers contributed, particularly Devlok Ji, Rajni Ma'am and Sarita Ghosh Ma'am. This was really an amazing experience. There were so many students who were not able to deliver even single sentences, but they were doing some outstanding jobs. And I really enjoyed being with them. We conducted multiple activities, including, including interview sessions, group discussion, presentation and many more. So in 10 days, it is really a Herculean task to teach each and everything. But daily a session of 90 minutes, it was simply brilliant, outstanding and we all the people really enjoyed. We had a ball. Today so many people insisted, insisted sir we want to come at the podium, we want to come at the podium. But we have picked four from here. So they will come, they will speak something. After that, one activity will take place. What is that activity? These all the people are going to tell you. So I would like to call at the podium, Mansha and Mayam. So give a big round of applause for them. Principal sir, teacher and my dear friends, I am Subham Kumar from class 19. We attend the English summer camp and this was a beautiful experience. We, we had a so many wonderful experiences. We enjoyed a lot. We were taught by so many teachers. Such as Deepak sir, Sarita Ghosh ma'am, Rajni ma'am and Devlok sir. We would like the, to call at the podium. Shri and Good morning everyone, my name is Gitanjali. Good morning everyone, my name is Shreya. And we are from 10th e. So we would like to tell you what we did in our previous days. So we did so many activities like grammar, presentation, role play and interview and we had so much fun. So Shreya, I would like to know what, was your, what is your experience? My experience is very amazing with all the teachers. All teachers are so nice and I love to uh, study with them. Can I conduct an activity with you? Yes, but it will be so fun. Okay, so I would like to invite all the students of our uh, camp, along Sarita Ghosh ma'am and Rajni ma'am to assist us. So we would like to invite one and only Devlok sir to the podium to face interview. Thank you. Good morning to everybody, the guests present on the stage and all my colleagues and my dear students. So we'll have to face the difficult questions that the students have learned during the English summer camp. Well now this is going to be an interview and these all the people are going to ask the question to Devlok ji. I hope you will enjoy this session. Don't be nervous, relax. <laughs> so myself Devlok Anand, teaching in this school since 2013. So it was a wonderful experience in this school with the students and with the management also. What is your family background? So in my family, I have a mother, an elder brother, my wife and two children and we live happily together. So why did you choose this profession? So this profession, you know, it is a, one of the most known professions in the world and in order to assist my country and the teachers of the nation, I have chosen this profession. So what are the quality of required to be a good teacher? So to be a good teacher, it is very important to be punctual, dutiful and work only. Sir, how do you pass your free time? So I usually pass my free time doing my hobbies, that is reading books and listening to music sometimes. How do you learn English? So I learn English from my father and my respected teachers who used to teach me greatly. What is your strength and weakness? So everybody has got a strength and my strength is uh, uh, concern and discipline. And uh, my weakness is that sometimes I, I do with a lie. Where do you hail from? I hail from Patna, the capital city of Bihar. What is your favorite food? My favorite food is rice and pulses. Who is your favorite teacher in this school and why? So it's a very difficult question to answer since all my colleagues are uh, very uh, wise and beautiful. Uh, but if you have asked a question, I must say that I'm of 
my favorite guru is Deepak sir and he is one of my favorite teacher who always provides me a kind of source of inspiration and motivation to guide the students. What did you learn from early principal Kishu Sharma sir? So uh, it's also a difficult question to tell. So we have not, we have, we all of us have learned a lot from the experience of sir. And Mr. Kesav Sharma sir, he was dutiful, he was workaholic, he was more of a very disciplined person. And uh, he guided us well and he made us learn everything, what not I should say. So what do you want to improve in this, this school? So nothing special ma'am, uh, as we said uh, that this is a school which is managed by our scholars managers and uh, vice managers and uh, everyone uh, teachers are very wise enough to teach the pupils. So I think a little improvement in the field of spoken English must be encouraged among the students and that will be a wise step. Something special did you learn from this school? Definitely it was discipline to be learned every time and to be how do we function that is also very important. And how, and how should we behave to our colleagues and our students? So I read my colleagues uh, giving them 10 out of 10 and to my students I will also give 10 out of 10 and to the management I am very uh, grateful. Thank you. Sir, I would love to ask you who inspired you to be a teacher? So it was my father and mother from where I got the inspiration of to be a teacher. They always told me that do something for the nation, do something for the country and do something for the society and this honestly inspired me to be a teacher. Okay, so what is your um, success mantra for the students if you give them any tip uh, regarding success uh, in, to achieve success in their life? So always speak the truth, be on the right path, be self-disciplined and be and manage your time in a very good way and that is the success mantra. I would say it was an amazing experience for all of us to having an interview with uh, Mr. Devlok sir. And for the further presentation, I hand over the micro microphone to Mr. Deepak Sharma. Thank you so much, sir. And thank you so much, sir. Uh, Devloji was absolutely outstanding. So give a big round of applause for Devloji. <laughs> and of course, the wonderful kids, they are really wonderful kids. They were quite nervous before coming here. They were actually performing very nice in the class. But when they were, they came over here, they were trembling, shaking, right? The girl was coming and she was saying to me, Sir, what's going on? I have a bit of So, there is no need to get any kind of panic. And I want to tell you that yesterday we conducted one activity where more than seven teachers visited our class and the interview of each and every one was taken by these wonderful kids. This was really a fantastic session. Uh, I would like to request uh, Right, Raman sir, Rajneesh sir and Sunitri ma'am that one day we all the teachers would like to conduct this session because we know that Raman sir is there but we don't know what actually Raman sir is. So one day we would like to conduct one interview of you all the people so that we can get to know about you all with your kind permission sir. Chaliye, sir said yes, so sir ke liye bhi bajade ek baar. 